Okay, I'm out of here. So we got a call for some sort of off-road vehicle out on the West Rim Trail. Worked out good because we were already headed this way for a trail ride. So the customer says that they were on the West Rim Trail and the radius arm on the rear wheel, like the rear axle, just snapped. So I think we're just gonna go up there and weld it together and send them on their way and then we're gonna continue our trail ride as planned. Sounds good to me. And it's beautiful weather outside, so it should be a good day. I gotta make sure everybody's in the right gears. I didn't give all the instructions. Are you in the right gear? What? Crawling gear? Yeah. Yeah, you're checking your I shirt. I was like, what? <laughs> He's got the uniform. Just checking here. You're in low, low, looks good. Yeah. This will pop out of front wheel drive on deceleration. I figured really that fun. out. <laughs> How's it looking in here? Hey, looking good. sure this doesn't pop out a low range anymore with nothing more than a chain of zip ties which is one of my signatures and a soft shackle which is one of my products <laughs> I forget how hot it gets inside this cab this was a professional off-road recovery high precision machine and it runs hot fast it runs very hot there is a visible difference between outside and in here <laughs> visible <laughs> there's a how do noticeable. i say that noticeable a noticeable there's a notable noticeable difference i think we just spotted our customer i can't see it oh right there <laughs> i was looking in front not to the side in right where it sets so wait they were doing this morning. they were doing a trail we were going to how's it look it's not too shabby all right oh yeah that's not bad to get to no i think let's get you gonna pull it together with a winch yeah i think yeah i think i'm just gonna pull back on the jeep yeah Somehow you need to pull forward on the axle. Uh, yeah, well, and I'm going to do that by pulling back on the Jeep All right, and blocking this tire. tire? Okay. Yeah. Okay. You just want to hook. And... I like this tire. Hey, well, I'm going to hook right here by your head, okay? Look how good that works. Yeah, it's a nice dog. Peanut's a good, good girl. 
All right, we're gonna be pulling on this, so we don't want anybody in this in this area. Should right I get here. peanut out, or no, you know, we're about peanut? Do you want to grind it while it's still apart a little bit? I think we can tack it and then grind it. Okay, Caitlin, will you get all the welding stuff out? So I need welding rod. I need both of the stingers, the hood, and the welding rods in there. All right, so Matt's so going to pull on the Jeep and he's got the tire chalked and this crack should just get sucked together when he winches. Okay, we're going to get this pulled back. Tom's going to tell me when it's in the right spot. Oh, that might be all we get. Go one more tap. Yep, it's just holding it tight now. Okay, does it look good? Yeah, there's a little gap, but I think that'll take filler rod really nice. Okay, that plugs into the black one right there. Oh, cool. Just kind of touching right there. Yeah. Okay, this is cool this how this works. You're learning. So there's some Slowly. gloves. Do you want a jacket? Yeah, you got one in there? You have to shake it off, probably. Scorpions in it? Yeah, get the snakes and scorpions out of it. All so right. This goes in the other side. Let's see this open. How come this is right here, Rhett? Uh, you... Because I thought we were going through. I didn't know well... we had a job. <laughs> well, you oh, yeah, it? he never got updated. Yeah, oh. I didn't know we had a job. <laughs> So as you can clearly see, this is a Premier Power Welder. These are awesome. These, for some reason, these weld better than like a commercial in-shop one. I don't know why. Okay, so turn it on. That tells us we're there. Now to weld, we need to be in the red red range. So this is our throttle. Probably start right there. We'll see how it goes. And that's it. That's how you control how you control the power there. Okay, we're gonna clean this up a little bit, grind out this crack, and then we should be ready to weld it up. Hey, Peanut. Ground. Let's put that right there. You tack your side, and then I'll tack my side, and then I'll start cleaning okay. it. Oh, listen to that. That is yeah. awesome. You with the helmet. Take the helmet. No, you didn't do it. Perfect. Okay. I need some glasses. Glasses are in the bag. These wire wheels are no joke. They'll poke you in the eye. They're like seagulls in the knees, man. I love the smell of the burning flux on stick electrode. You want to give me the hood and I'll, and I'll run a beat on the back now? Okay. We are sitting really fast and pretty right here. I think you'd get off the trail as it is, but yeah. I, mean, I think I could get, I think it'd be up a little more. Well, I want to put this right here. Maybe you can put this on the side or something, or on the top. Yeah. And then this one, I was just going to put lengthwise right here. It's so ugly, but I think it's strong. All right, I feel like that's as strong as it's going to get on my side. Okay, I'm out of here. All right, that should get him off the trail. There's a lot of steel. Hold that together. I wouldn't leave it that way for a long time, but it's gonna work today. How's it looking? It's looking good enough. It'll get off the trail. Okay, I'm gonna relax this. Okay, okay here it goes. How do you turn off the idle? Woo! Okay, it's idling nice. Oh, who turned this off? Don't do that yet. Yeah. Well, you probably were okay, but you, if you turn this off when it's not down here all the way to the bottom, it will the alternator will catch on fire, explode, and leak plutonium. Oh. And battery acid everywhere. Okay. Raining for days. Okay. Really um, careful. We didn't have a training meeting on this. Yeah. Okay. It's a fun thing to train on. We should. I'm going to train Caitlin right now because it's strike two. Come over here. What am I doing? This is like the, the Freightliner, the Jeeps the forklift, 
and GM cars from like 1950 to 1985. Okay. And the banana. And the banana. One turn. This is accessories and will drain the battery. Okay. That was a stern talking to she just got. Here's the tragedy. Johnny Boy flew his plane down this morning to wheel his Bronco. Yes. Which has been running great this whole time. He Until jumped in it. I jump in and try to turn the key. Nothing. Nothing. It ran this morning. It was going hours right. before he got here. Yeah, Rhett drove it up to the shop to put a flag mount on it. And then an hour later when he jumped in it, nothing. There's something wrong with the fuel injection. We would have it out here. Like, that's what you came down here for. That's what I came here for. So we're all very sad. Hands out of pockets, truck back together. <laughs> you got a system here? No. Okay. No, we'll we, do. Do, we do not have a Show system. We're going to do it that way. We try. We need this a lot. Let's put it on the top. Yeah. <laughs> it's like one of those sleeping bags that you don't have to roll up anymore. You just stuff a them stuff in. Stuff sack. These yeah. are our stuff sacks. Yeah. Okay, no, this should. will get you off the trail. It's very reliable. It's very strong. But it won't keep me going. It will not. <laughs> Take it home and, and then do something different. Like, yeah. Or there. just so grind we'll it down and reinforce it. So we'll be good here for a couple days? Or no? You can call mm. us again if it breaks. <laughs> it won't. It won't do anything different. We're from than northern it Utah, yeah. so. So you're here for a little bit. We're yeah, here. We're planning on hanging out here till next one. Monday. Yeah, this, this is day one. one. Oh, this is day one. Hey, oh. Amber. So you get, you I love get that you shirt. remember my name. This is so nice. Thank you. Okay, oh there you go. Thanks for calling. Thanks. Okay, we're gonna grab some lunch and then we're gonna go finish the trail ride we set out to do this morning before we got this call. Got a Del Taco, some sort of burrito. These are massive. There's gonna be an awesome trunk or treat and car show at O'Reilly's in Hurricane, October 30th. It starts at six, come and get candy. There's gonna be live music, giveaways, and other stuff. Come meet the team and see the more bear and the record. Lunch was amazing, and now we're gonna continue on. We're gonna go do the maze. Johnny Boy is now driving the wrecker. I hope he doesn't break it like he broke his Bronco. That's right. At least I gotta drive something today. Okay, this is gonna be a redemption run for me. There's that big drop up here that I lost my brakes on last time. <laughs> Woohoo! Hopefully I got it together right. Okay, it's gonna do some weird things, but you're okay. This is your redemption run, man. This is. I've been here before. A little more driver. <laughs> Look at that. Straighten it out. <laughs> well, Tom definitely had the most daylight under his back tires out of everybody that went down. May's light and now we've got to go do a recovery on Caitlin's dad apparently his buggy caught on fire and he's near the top of the world so that's where we're going now what did you do I caught it on fire 
It looks like a tranny line that runs over the exhaust melted through coming up these dunes. Flames started shooting out. All right, so, well, we'll go hook up to it and get it out of here. Uh, but then I saw flames and more smoke than I normally see. So I uh, got it pulled over immediately. Um, I grabbed one of our fire extinguishers and they grabbed one of theirs. And we sprayed it down and got it. Oh, this thing's so, awesome. Look at that engine. Sure just too much tranny fluid. In That's fact, cool. we tried to start it. It immediately smoked and tranny fluid was dripping. You're wow. not allowed to have fires in here, Kevin. We're going to have to have <laughs> you live. You can't leave them <laughs> alone in no anything. Fire zone? <laughs> do you want to flat tow this or do you want to pick it up? I think it would be best to pick it up because it's full hydro. Yes. And they do not steer very easily with full hydro. <laughs> Oh yeah, Jamie's trapped. <laughs> Hi, Jamie. Hi. Let me get a tool. You need to break the window? Brandy needs to do a little maintenance on this and put some WD-40 or something on this seatbelt so you can get it open and closed yeah. easily. All right, so when your seatbelt won't come open, grab yourself an adjustable wrench and adjust it. Oh, just my luck, I grabbed the standard and this is a metric. Oh, thank you. So, Tom, I'm thinking we got to get our really super duper tough straps. You want to do the X brace and everything? So, when we strap it down, we wrap it around right here. I just don't want to ca it ca catch up here, so I think I'm gonna have I'm gonna have to go grab right here. Okay. grab down here. I'm thinking of a flat strap though. Oh yeah. So the big wide. Yeah. And going way under here. Let's yeah. Grab, grab, some, grab stuff. some stuff. Well, it was everywhere. <laughs> It was coming out of here and of here, or? no way, <laughs> and here, and as soon as I saw flames, I got it pulled over and I was out. But we carry fire extinguishers, so I'm glad we do. Okay, just do what I'm doing. Okay. So go over that outside yeah. link. I'll be strong. Okay. So then you just undo this like this. Oh, fancy. It is fancy. They you guys just got invented the fancy them. Stuff. That's how we roll. Very fancy around here. Oh, yeah. I'm noticing. <laughs> All right. Oh, did the brake go to the floor? That's going to make that's gonna make your ride out quickie. Do you have anything for those cars? Okay. This is going to be a wild ride. So no brakes, only hand brakes. We got, we got cutting brakes. Grateful for cutting brakes. Luckily, because... If you look at the pedal, I got there's nothing there. No more shackles. Bombie style. So I wonder if the front brake lines melted because they run up through there. But for right now, this should kind of control it swinging side to side. Okay, okay Caitlin, your job is to keep this tight. Okay. Ignore so these. Drag brakes on, on the, the brakes. downhill. You can let off on the uphill. Okay. And don't heat your brakes up. All right, we got the buggy hooked up. We got Caitlin back there to run the brakes and we are headed off the dunes. That away. And then that way. I wasn't worried enough to slow down, but I was worried. Okay. Yeah, it was, I was All of this ID. goes in here, I think. <laughs> so I got recovered, so I get a shirt. Even though you work for them, this is the only way I can get one. <laughs> Next time you want to replace the brakes. You don't need to catch the buggy on fire. I'll try not to. Thank you. All right, we got both of those jobs done, plus a trail ride. If you'd like to see a long format of both of these jobs, plus the trail ride, you can go to this link right here, and download the app. We got a lot of stuff like that that's just too long and boring for YouTube, but it's amazing. It's amazing stuff. <laughs> too long and boring, but it's incredible. You're not going to want to miss it. Thanks for watching. You don't need to worry about gas today because we picked up tacos. Ha <laughs> ha!
<laughs> are, you, are you saying you got gas before? I'm not explaining, I'm just saying we got tacos. <laughs>